we want to hear about your personal preferences, your personal experiences. Say what you call oral sex between you and your partner. We don't have a cutesy name for for oral sex necessarily. It's just about, uh, I mean, my boyfriend has a cutesy name for, he calls it my, his muffin. <laughs> yeah. I make love to my partner mm -hmm. and with my mouth instead of that's the name for me. Yeah. It's totally making love for me. It's not a foreplay. It's really a big part of it. So once you go down, you never go up. <laughs> <laughs> I call it a bizu. Okay. Um, okay. Yes. So he knows what, what it is. Oh. Yeah. I don't really have a name for the, the action itself. I mean, you always have a little, little name for you. Know. I would think his thing, I call it the monster. The monster! Can <laughs> you <laughs> talk a little bit about your first experience with oral sex? My first experience with receiving oral sex, um, I was uncomfortable mm -hmm. because it was the first time and I didn't know what did he, what do you want me to do? He wants me to like make noise or he wants me to like, you know, move my body to like let him know that I like it or not. Like I didn't even know if I liked it or not. I was like, this is just like kind of, but um, yeah, I was like, okay, uh, don't look at him. You know? <laughs> I am bisexual since ever, mm -hmm. and my very first experience was with a woman because that's how I wanted, that that's how I desired. Mm -hmm. I don't remember the first oral sex with guy, but I remember with the girl. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't thinking anything. I wasn't planning. I wasn't thinking what I've seen in movies or whatever. I just followed my feelings and passion and it was like direct, yeah. total pleasure. Mm. The best sex is always when you're not thinking about anything yeah, else right. except mm. for the energy and like the, the passion yeah. and the, yeah. you know, physical sensations that you're feeling. I remember having my first orgasm through oral sex. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that's why I think I like oral yeah. sex. <laughs> and I remember like my legs just shaking so much. Oh. I'm like, I'm gonna kill this guy. <laughs> <laughs> But it was really good. I was, I think I was... He survived. <laughs> yes, he <Yeah>. survived. <laughs> um, so let's talk a little bit about what do you like and not like about oral sex. A lot of people are, you know, for self, it's like, oh, you're receiving, receiving, receiving. But I think giving is also so great. It makes you feel really yeah. sexy. Yeah, if definitely. You, you know, if you're able you to give pleasure to your, yeah, to yeah. your partner, you know. Yeah. Yeah. I am the boss. You dominate the person as well. I mean, mm -hmm. it's kind of domination. Yeah, because they like succumb to you, you know, in that moment when they're, you know, orgasming or whatever. It's like mm -hmm. you caused that, you know? Exactly. Like, yeah. Yeah. Smile on. Very good. Yeah. Smile on. <laughs> like done because of me. Oh. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what are some of the things that you don't like about oral sex? When someone tries to rush it. Oh my yeah. god. That is the worst. <laughs> when someone uses like their chin. <laughs> what? You know what I mean? Like that is just, has, it has I'm, happened I'm, to everybody, I'm right? Sure. <laughs> that me neither. I'm just sure it is. That is just like a guy thinks like, oh, maybe this will stimulate. Oh my God, <laughs> it's prickly. No like, hello. Oh, they have no you know? idea what to do. Terrible. Yeah. They think they, you know, men. that like in porn where you like dig your face into somebody's pussy, that like that's how you're supposed to do it. You know, like that. It's like, oh, it's not like get in my pussy. It's not. It's like you know, it's. Time, by the way, seriously, like porn destroys yes. everything. Yeah, yeah, because guys like watch that and they think that that's what it is. Yeah, like, hello, right. <laughs> women exist. It's not just about you. Yeah, <laughs> or like on the guy's side, if he's taking too long, seriously, that's such a turn off. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like if you're down there for like half an hour and you're like, my jaw is gonna <laughs> stick in that position for like the next three days. Yeah. I'm like, all right, that's enough, come on. Yeah, yeah hurry up. Give me I have five. to say it. So have you ever had any experiences where the actual taste of your partner was bad or good or what you associated that with? You know, I can definitely say that I wouldn't mind it tasting like something else. <laughs> I'll deal with it, you know, because it makes you feel good and then that makes me feel good. It's for love. But it's like, yeah, it's for love. It's for love. So you wouldn't put it in your ice cream? Oh, I'm sorry, not the best thing. It's no coconut, but if it was coconut. Yeah, yeah right? Yeah. It would help. Like, it's it's true. True. Oh, no. coconut would be yeah. like a pleasure. Yeah. So would something like Bob be better for oral sex then? Yeah, definitely. I mean, for me, yeah. that's kind of where we're going. Yeah. Well, if it's gonna taste like coconut and not have the <laughs> calorie count of a yeah. coconut shake, <laughs> well, for women, it's gonna bring up confidence because you know some women have real issues with like 
feeling like even if they're clean, you know, <coughs> you still to a certain extent. Sure. Yeah, exactly. It's a little bit of an insecurity. So, you know, maybe you're going to feel just that much more confident about, you know, having oral sex. And, you know, if it's for a man, I would not mind a, a, a nicer tasting uh, free gum. Yeah. <laughs> if you're taking something that you know that's going to make you smell better. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. What can make it even better? Bob? even better yeah the good will be better it's like heaven yeah. I don't know there's no, no way to lose <laughs> oh god we're gonna do oh, all day yeah okay. <laughs> god after all this talk I'm just like just go home and like where's my boyfriend <laughs>